Yeah, my emotions uh, are just after the announcement are just uh, feelings of excitement, really. It's kind of a bit more getting more real uh, as every day passes, really. Um, we're going to be going to Rio for the Olympics. So, yeah, I think that's kind of what we've been uh, aiming for for the last year or so. So now, yeah, just real, real excitement. Um, so we've got our last bits of training to do uh, before we leave. But, yeah, just generally really looking forward to going and uh, seeing what Rio brings. Yeah, being part of uh, London 2012 was something that was quite exciting. Um, I don't think I really performed as well as I would have liked to. Um, so, yeah, I can kind of use that energy and, uh, and that experience from the last time in, in a positive way and try and... Uh, try and sort of get a better result in Rio and um, yeah just try and perform to, to what I know I'm, I'm capable of. I think uh, men's single is a very tough event um, there's a lot of strong players in there and I think if I play to, to my capabilities I can get to the quarterfinals and then uh, from then on it's just see what happens. I think in my discipline I'll probably expect uh, the top Chinese guys uh, Lin Dan Chen Long and uh, the top Malaysian guy Li Chong Wei at the moment they're the top three guys in the world and uh, yeah they've I think between the, the, th the three of them, they've won a lot of the big tournaments in the last sort of year, 18 months. So, yeah, those are the three guys to sort of watch out for. The gap is closing between them and the, the rest of the field. But, yeah, I think those are the three to really watch out for.